Right guys, welcome back. Hope we're all having a great evening and we're all doing well. So something insanely funny and cool, in my opinion, just got leaked. If you guys who don't know, earlier this week it was rumoured that Warner Brothers were working on their own Smash Brothers style game. And it's quite funny, ever since the development of Smash Brothers was coming to an end, it seemed like every company were hopping on the bandwagon and hoping to put their own version out. Nickelodeon All-Star Smash, I believe it was called, just released and I've not picked it up. I think people are decently enjoying it but i think a lot of people just bought it for like the whole funny aspect of it's like a you know smash brothers game with spongebob i don't think that game was enough for me to you know go out and buy it i'm still fine with smash brothers i much prefer the roster in that so the nickelodeon one just wasn't for me however it seems like now warner brothers are going to be releasing their own and in my opinion warner brothers has a much better roster of characters at their disposal so actually thanks to hungrybox who i believe was like the original poster of this we actually got a leaked image at the roster for for Warner Brothers Multiverses, which can I say is a sick name. The character select screen goes as follows, according to Hungrybox, the one at the top left is just a brand new character for the game, then you've got Steven Universe, Batman, Harley Quinn, Finn, Jake, Shaggy, Superman, Wonder Woman, Gandalf, Rick Sanchez, Bugs Bunny, and Tom and Jerry. Now that is what you call a good roster for a fighting game. As far as I'm aware, we don't know how far along this game is, so there could be more people joining the fight. If they've got Gandalf on here, I think a really good sword character could be Aragon. Heck, they could even have a character like the Pokemon trainer from uh, Smash Brothers, where you've got Aragon, Legolas, and Gimli, and you can switch between the three of them. But yeah, this is like the second high level high name smash clone which has appeared in the past few months and is making me wonder what company is going to make their own smash clone next i guarantee you it probably won't be too long until disney release their own one with marvel star wars pixar and disney characters sort of like a disney infinity style smash game but yeah, this Warner Brother one actually seems quite fun. I think it's quite cool to play as all these characters. I think this art style looks pretty nice. I quite like how they all look. So hopefully we get the official announcement of the game soon because this does look pretty fun. And I'm probably going to be more inclined to pick this one up than the Nickelodeon one. And hopefully this isn't the final roster because there's so many more cool characters which they could add to this. But yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below about Warner Brothers Multiverses. I think it sounds pretty fun and I am excited to see more about it. But yeah guys, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to drop it a like dislike it if you did not let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and have an incredible rest of your day i love you all stay safe peace